my play pals thank you so much for clicking on this video and if you're new to our channel click that red subscribe button ring that notification bell so you get updates anytime we upload new videos now today guys i'm doing another unboxing of the new lol surprise jk mini fashion dolls now previously guys i unboxed neon qt and i will insert a card above if you guys want to check that video out she was definitely one of the ones that i wanted but also, MC Swag, I wasn't going to get her, but one of my awesome subscribers actually left a comment stating that she was interested in knowing what her hair looked like. And that kind of piqued my interest as well because I wanted to know. Swag is one of my favorites. She's a fellow Leo, just like me. And if you guys are keeping track, yes, my birthday is later this month and it is almost Leo season. So I'm very excited. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to unbox MC Swag and we'll see how she compares to her sister. But you guys know I love to style my dolls and what I did was I gave Swag a different look. I actually gave her these glasses that I made. And the funny thing is I made these glasses a little while back and I thought they kind of looked a lot like MC Swag right there, her glasses on the little mini swag. So I thought that was kind of cool. Anyway, so anyway, I have her kind of, you know, she's all gold and red today. So she's got on these glasses that I created and she's got on 24K DJ's little jacket. Man, this, this jacket is everything. Um, I know 24K DJ is hard to get. If they ever re-release her, I'm getting like two, at least two more of her because she's awesome. Anyway, um, so Swag has on her little like bodysuit underneath. She's got this little belly chain thing, this little hip chain that I got from Honka Tour around her waist and that's cute. She's got on her original pants and I love the little print on Swag with a little money sign. And this little dollar sign is so cool. Um, it actually kind of looks like Gucci, so I love it. And um, I gave her 24K DJ's boots because I know they had regular Timberlands on her, but you know, Tims are cute and everything, no lie. But this girl's all blinged out with the, you know, money and gold and everything. So I thought gold boots looked a lot better on her. So I gave her this new look. You guys let me know in the comments below what you think about my swag out swag. Okay, the other thing that I wanted to point out, guys, is off camera, I did unbox from series one of the little like furniture collections that you can get that comes with a doll and it comes with different accessories. It might come with like a little kitchen set or whatever. I mean, there's like a ton of little things they're coming up with, which is great for your dollhouse. If you collect the dollhouses, I have a dollhouse. I haven't put it all together yet, mm, long story. But I do have um, the LOL Surprise dollhouse and they are coming out with a new dollhouse and word on the street is they're also coming out with an OMG size one guys and I will be there for your girls and I probably would want to get one of those because I love the OMGs. It's, you know, they're a doll collector's dream. But anyway, I love the little sisters too because I think they're great for, you know, doing photos and creating all kinds of different scenes and they're just cute little girls. So anyway, love this doll and so I do have an LOL Surprise uh little sister collection i even have like the lils and little babies or whatever and some pets too i'll have to show you guys sometime um i'm really into the bigger dolls the fashion dolls because i'm all about the fashion and dressing them up i mean i love 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 that but anyway these are cute too but what i did was i unboxed her because i want to compare her to her jk sister and i want to see if there's any differences between them and be able to show you guys so if you already have this little girl right here you can know whether or not you want to get the mini fashion doll so there's a couple things that i did want to point out before we get to the unboxing guys there's 15 surprises inside these girls have real hair which is cool and they come with all kinds of things this is series one so you know they're gonna get more mc swag right here she is cute and there's some other ones now previously i did unbox neon qt diva's on the way so i'm going to be able to unbox her mc swag is today and queen b uh, i might unbox her in the future we'll see because you know we <laughs> I don't know, MC Swag might be way cuter than what I thought and then I'll be like, oh, I gotta have them all. I mean, after all, if I did get her, I might want the rest. Um, one of the cool things about this, I'm gonna go ahead and take some tape and stuff off and we'll get going. But once you take this off, it kind of bounces up and down. So this is kind of cool. It's like a little zipper. Okay guys, so without any further delays, let's go ahead and get to this unboxing and see what's inside. all the tape out and so now what we're going to do is we are going to take a look and right here it says extra next level fierce mc swag so let's go ahead and open it up i'm gonna pull that out 
and let's see there we go so we're gonna open it right here now cool now look at that play set guys that's nice she's got her little mirror she's got her swag bag that's what I call it and um, her little boom box this is so cute I love it and look so she's got her little garment bags and stuff and some little the garment bags are right there and they're just like big sis um, in terms of like the patterns and stuff and so she's got some little items in here so let's go ahead and take these all out okay so we got everything out so she's got three of these little blind bags that we can open up two garment bags and a bag and then she also has this little accessory box love it i love the little two-tone how they mixed it up for these girls and then you know the fact that she hers is like her big sister's colors like the gold and then the red i mean this goes together so well it's like i planned this right <laughs> no i didn't but anyway um that's pretty cool so we're gonna start first with this shoe box size three and a half with her platform little uh timberland so we'll have to see what they look like Oh, how cute is that? Adorbs, guys. Adorbs. And she's got like little gold like laces on those. They're kind of cute. So next up, guys, is the accessory box. So we're going to open that up and see what is in here. Hope she's got some cool accessories. Oh, nice. Okay, so she has a hat, guys. And this hat is like the little money Gucci, the swag Gucci. Swagucci? I'll call it Swagucci. So she's got a Swagucci hat. And she's got some glasses, which are cute and are similar to the ones that I created. Um, it's got like a little chain going across here, which is cool. And she has her own little like cell phone there with the BBs on there. Hey, she's got to charge her phone. She's running out of battery. And she's got a little necklace, guys. This is so cute. We're going to have to put that on her. I love this little garment bag, guys. The big one, I love it. And so this is so cute. Anyway, I'll open that and see what she's got. Oh, this is cute. I don't know how it's gonna look on her, but she's got a Swagucci long skirt. Cute. Here's this other bag right here. Let's see what's inside. She's got a Swagucci top. Kind of like her big sis, but I didn't put it on her. You guys know I did a total remix on her and put some instant rap play touches on her. But anyway, she's got this little top. And then this is our little bag right here. Open this up. Ooh, she's got a soda pop bottle. Cute. Our doll is in here. So we're going to pop this up and take her out in a sec. But I wanted to show you guys again. This is so cute. Boop, boop. Ooh, you can kind of see how she would look shorter, like a regular LOL doll or a tallie. So anyway, don't we all wish we could wear platform shoes and be tall? Anyway, <laughs> um, let's see. So we're gonna open this up. Here's some information in here. Be sure to read it. Um, some of these dolls, it says they could be color changers and stuff. I'm not gonna get my doll wet because I don't want to mess her up. So I'm not gonna even try to see if she's a color changer. Sorry, uh, maybe in the future, but not today, because we want to look fabulous. So anyway, let's go ahead and reveal our girl. Oh my goodness, look at her. Not at all what I thought, but interesting. Interesting, okay. Hmm. So let's go ahead and get her all out of the package right now. So we got a girl all out, but before I do the big reveal, I wanted to show you guys that inside there's a couple things. She's got a brush and she also has uh, a stand. She is just like Big Sis and they have doll sand. So we'll be sure to use that doll sand. Okay, that's our girl. That's what she looks like out of the package. Um, the only thing I'll say, first of all, she's cuter than I thought. I love the fact that she has on like real little clothes or whatever, so that's kind of cool. And the only thing is her hair. This little tigerous like highlight, I'm not sure I'm down with it. I'm not sure it's my favorite. But I think it's kind of cool. Oh, she has a little rubber band right there. I'll take that out later. Anyway, um, anyway, I'm, I can't say that I'm a big fan of that. But I guess they had to give her something. They wanted to, you know, make her stand out. 
so I don't want MC Swag to feel bad, but we'll see. She'll still be in my collection and I will adore her, but I probably would have adored, adored her a little more if her hair was a little different. So, anyway, yeah, this almost looks like it could have been for like alt girls little sister or something. I don't know. But you guys let me know what you think in the comments below. And so what we're gonna do right now is let's get our girl all dressed and see what she looks like in her outfit. Okay, so I have MC Swag all dressed, guys, and yeah. I'm really having a lot of trouble falling in love with this. I really am. And I kind of knew I would have issues with this because it's just kind of long and it comes down so far. It just kind of looks like she's on stilts or something. I kind of feel like if they created some kind of like split here in the front so you could have seen it, like make it more like pants, just like they did for her big sis. That could have been a little cuter, but this kind of straight tube skirt with the little shoes like that, I, I don't know. It just looks bizarre to me. And the hair, not feeling it. So I normally love everything LOL Surprise, but I'm not a fan of this. And you know, but I will say that I really did like Neon QT, okay? So anyway, I'm not a hater on all JK dolls, but, and I'm a fan of swag. So it, it really pains me to say that I'm not a super huge fan of this. Well, but you know, I'm a collector. So I'm glad that I collected it so I can have it, you know, maybe 10 years from now, I'll be like, oh, I remember I got that JK doll. I don't know. So you guys let me know what you think about it in the comments below. So time for a quick comparison of her and her little set. Now they both have hats. The original one comes with a hat that says baby on the back. And our JK doll came with the swag Gucci hat. And so that's kind of cool. I like that because they can, you know, share hats and you can do some styling and stuff with them. So I think that's kind of dope. You know, look at that. Woo -woo. Anyway, that could be kind of cool to play with. And if you compare the two, okay, so her eye makeup is different. The JK doll actually has blue eyeshadow. That's different. Of course, the hair is different because this one has real hair and this one has like the rubber hair or whatever. But their brows and everything look pretty much the same. So no major differences there. The face is pretty much the same for the most part. Um, I don't see any major differences. This was like a, a release of the original doll, but this one actually came in uh, the playset uh, with the car and everything that I got. So I wanted to unbox it to show you guys what the difference is, just in case you decide, hey, I wanna get her and, um, you know, to add to your collection or whatever. So unfortunately, I'm not gonna do a water test, but um, you guys let me know what you think, what you think about the outfit that I created for swag over there. Okay guys, that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play. We did an unboxing of the LOL Surprise JK Mini Fashion Dolls. We unbox NC Swag. You guys let me know in the comments below what you think about this girl. Hey guys, before we go, I wanna give a super shout out to some of my awesome subscribers. Thank you guys for clicking and sticking with me. You guys have been so awesome. You've been leaving me comments. You've been watching my videos. You've been sharing them with people and inviting people to come here. And I appreciate it so much. It has really helped my channel grow. So thank you guys for supporting my doll habit and my channel. And that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you have a hard day, we hope you find some time to play. And we'll see you next time on Instant Ride Play. That's what it's all about. We are